All right, guys, it happened. It's me, Spidey Steve, and here I'm reviewing the official images for the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild slash Ocreana of Time set. It looks really good. I'm going to dive into it real quick. But let's go through each of these pictures. Starting with this, it is the Great Deku Tree 2 in 1. I'm not super familiar with everything going on here, but I think that is a very cool build. I think it looks very good. Also like the thing here. What I'm really focusing on is the mini figs here, which look amazing. But we'll, we're gonna have to get to that here in a minute. This design is really good. I really like the way that they've um, created the base here. I think it would have looked a little bit better if it had that black outline, just to be more of an official looking, like professional model. The box art looks great, I guess, for um, 18 plus set. And then let's see here good loop around to see if we can get a good view of the interior. It looks like there's some sort of play mechanism here. Nice little bed, camp area. Oh, there's something up there. Uh, just a little secret area, I guess. That's cool. I love the way the roots are made with those bendy pieces. That looks really good. Okay, so here's a second build. So this is from Okriana time, I guess. If I can play it. Oh, here we are. So this looks good, too. I really like the leaves up there. There's something creepy. I really like the old Link, is, or the original kind of Link style here. And Young Link is here too, with that nice shield and sword. Ooh, I like the way that they use the Harry Potter hit piece as well. Look at these minifigures a little bit closer. So, I'm gonna kind of go through it. So, I love Zelda. Zelda looks great. I'm really glad they went with that outfit, because I really liked it. In the opening cutscene to Tears of the Kingdom, it looks really good. And Link here looks great. I love the shield and the Master Sword here. This hairpiece, really good. It's this face that's bothering me a little bit. It doesn't look quite right to me. My favorite face using for um, Link is actually Draco Malfoy's from the Harry Potter series. That torso print and that leg print looks great. I love the continuation of the shirt. I think I personally, I, I've done the, like a separate cloth piece for that. Let's see if we can get a better view of minifigs from the side here or without the shield block in the print if it's high enough quality no it's not i think the torso print looks pretty good though now um this minifigure also looks great i'm glad that they went with dual molds for the arms and the legs for i think all of these characters yeah all of these characters they look really good too and the young link does as well i can't tell if that's dual mold i think it must be or the like tri mold thing that they do for the legs now that's a cool thing i don't know what that's called Anyway, this looks like a really cool set. If you guys want to see my custom minifigure for it, uh, stay tuned. It's going to be coming out tomorrow, at least the design phase part of it. So you guys should go check that out. Thank you for watching this little sneak peek of the Legend of Zelda sets.